G'day guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now today, I'm going to be reacting to some more AFL TikToks. I did this a couple of weeks ago and you guys seemed to like it. So I asked you guys on Instagram to DM me save TikToks so I could react to them. Before we get into the video, I just wanna give a quick shout out to everyone who has subscribed to my YouTube channel. 36% of my viewers are subscribed, but 64% of you guys who watch aren't subscribed. I'd love to start ticking over my subscriber numbers. I think it would be unbelievable. We're sort of on the road to 100K. I think it's gonna take a little bit of time, but that's the goal in the next couple of years. So if you haven't subscribed yet, hit the subscribe button, join the Dosso Army, and let's try and grow the channel as big as we can. AFL Media, when St Kilda, Gold Coast, and North Melbourne lose. Don't worry, don't worry, look. I'm here to help you. Please don't get upset. Hey, don't worry. Listen, 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 AFL Media listen. and Carlton fuck and up, Collingwood fuck lose. Fuck up, fuck up, fuck up, <laughs> get out. <laughs> that is so good. I love that sort of stuff. But Gordon Ramsay is so funny. Oh no, he shanked it. He's absolutely shanked it, the lad. Running out of defense and he shanked it out on the full. The poor fella. Well done, Geordie. Thanks for sending that in, mate. Cooper has sent in a AFL TikTok. Tom Hickey, just wandering from club to club, Tommy Hickey. <laughs> yeah, Tom Hickey, he's been around the bush, hasn't he? He's been around the block, he's played for a few sides. James Brayshaw is an AFL commentator here in Australia who often just goes, Oh, Mike. He's got another one! He's got another one! Oh, they're 51 open! Oh, Pendlebury's got it! He's kicking it! He's going back to the middle! Back to the middle. It's Pendlebury! It's Pendlebury's got it! That's Jack Post and Radio Mike talking about James Brayshaw. Yeah, he does do the oh. That is so funny. AFL lookalikes from AFL.media. <laughs> from the office. The Shermanator. That's a good one. Napoleon Dynamite. That's very good. Couple of ripping lookalikes. AFL biggest brawl of the season 2020. The Giants and the Dogs love a little bit of biff, don't they? There's a genuine rivalry between these two clubs. It's unbelievable. Sammy Lloyd's got a nick on the eye. That's so funny. A little bit of push and shove never hurt. I rate it. Type of AFL fend-offs. Dusty Martin. Toby Green with the kick. Andrew Cap with the punch. Joel Selwood, what's he going to do? Oh, dives head first. 2020 no footy, AFL highlight has put that TikTok up and it was sent to me by Luke. That is so funny. Thomas has sent in, I think this is Coach Come Cole. Come on down and grab yourself a bargain. We've got a great range of aluminium ladders and if you're a North Melbourne supporter, we're taking off 50% to help you start learning how to climb a ladder for next season. We've got 10% off on all Collingwood branded products. The Eddie Maguire shovels are great if you're looking to dig yourself in a deeper hole. <laughs> <laughs> if you mention the name Jeff Brown, yes, we'll throw good. in a free mop to help with presidential spills. We've got a big sale on on the Gary Lyon endorsed mowers, which of course are great for cutting your mate's grass. <laughs> so get in quick, get your cold face on, because these products will go as quick as you can say, Anthony Franchina. Coach Carl, he's funny. Yeah, he's very funny. Some of his interviews after games are all time. Geordie Bishop, if AFL players were fat. I was a rising chicken. Oh, Dusty's caked it on. Oh, Fifey. Whatever they've used is so good. It does it, <laughs> it does it really, really well. Oh, the big orange. Oh, that doesn't look right, does it? Tommy, get a Kados. This is one of my favorite AFL TikToks. Welcome back, winners. How you all feeling? Round 12. Are confident? Are you confident, mate? Woo! Yeah, we're back. Never count us out. We're here. We're ready to go. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, we are too. Do we face you guys again? <laughs> no. Thank God. Uh, any close <laughs> You guys look a bit nervous. We wanted to keep it close, you know? This bloke has <laughs> heaps of jumpers. But yeah, we kept it close. But how good is it to crush an enemy in the last quarter, eh? Yeah, I know what that's like. Who said we can't travel? Wasn't it only Carlton? Who else has beaten Carlton? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wait, wait. Is there one here, though? Good old Hollywood forever! 
<laughs> Not bad by Jakey there. That's quality. Uh, that's sent in from Tom. That's one of his favourite AFL TikTokers. Yeah, that's great. Types of people at AFL games. That's every bit of merchandise. The one who's never been to a game. The umpire abuser. The one who always blocks the view. Oh, the one who's always blocks the view. That is... That happened. I was at the MCC at Melbourne Hawthorne and we were right at the aisle above the bars and every quarter people were just in our way. So we had to move spots. It was really, really frustrating. Bailey Smith, I really like eating McDonald's. Teenage girls. <laughs> They're whipping up a McDonald's store for him. That's quite funny. Kid, can I meet Dusty Martin? We have Dusty Martin at home. <laughs> I think Matty Park is going to be good for the Tigers, to be fair. A couple of ripping, uh, ripping TikToks there. Archie from Seven Sport has sent in a banner fail. Everyone falls over running into banners, especially junior banners. The tape is so strong across that people just absolutely eat it. You've got to get better at creating the banners, I reckon. Guy Birch has sent in a video. The Blues were absolutely not back. They would go on to win five of their next 17 games. <laughs> Less than 12 months from the declaration, the club would launch a full review of the football department, leaving loyal fans devastated and embarrassed, hoping that one day they will experience success. Blue Abroad, very good on all social medias. If you want to see passionate Blues fans, go onto the Blue Abroad YouTube channel after a win or a loss. They do a fan cam segment where uh, people get to Skype in and chat to Terry, the host, and talk about the game, whether they win or lose. And it has been entertaining the last couple of weeks uh, with a couple of mundane performances. But the Blues will be back, I reckon. Orcs. So, Melbourne, Sydney is looking like pretty All of a sudden, a lot, of, lot of the Dees fans at the moment are sitting there going 10-0, 11-0. I think after what they've seen tonight... Hold your horses. That, yes, hold your horses, honey. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> Please don't call me honey again. Uh, we don't know. <laughs> it wasn't it. You haven't seen the ad from back in the day. Brad Johnson and Jordan Lewis can get real weird with Kath Lachlan late on a Saturday night, can't they? That, that was a little bit bizarre from John. Oh, hopefully it was just a little bit of misplaced banter. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for me reacting to AFL TikToks. I appreciate everyone who sent in the TikToks to react to and I appreciate the TikTokers who made some of the ones that we shared today. I'll be keen to do this video again soon guys so if you want to follow me on Instagram and wait until I post a story saying to send me some TikToks then that'll be unreal but once again I appreciate the support, I appreciate everyone getting around the videos and I'll see you all very very soon. Cheers.